children! It's me again, Teacher Michelle. Today, we will learn about Roman numerals. Roman numerals is a numeration system used in ancient Rome. Letters are used to write Roman numerals. Each letter or symbol has an equivalent value. Here are the letters from the alphabet that are used to represent numbers. The symbol I is equal to 1. V is equal to 5. X is equal to 10. L is equal to 50. C is equal to 100. D is equal to 500. And M is equal to 1000. These letters are put together to write different numbers. There is no such thing as a place value in writing Roman numerals. Instead, the values that the letter represents are combined to make the number. In writing Roman numerals, we need to remember the four rules. First, rule of repetition. Second, rule of addition. Third, rule of subtraction. Fourth, rule of multiplication. Let us learn each rule one by one. Rule number one, rule of repetition. Letters I, X, C, and M can only be repeated up to three times. Examples, we can write one as I, two as I, I, and three as I, I, I. X as 10, X, X as 20, and X, X, X as 30. C as 100, C, C as 200, and C, C, C as 300. M as 1000, M, M as 2000, M, M, M as 3000. The letters V, L, and D are cannot be repeated. These are symbols for 5, 50, and 500. Now, let us look at the second rule. Rule number 2, rule of addition. Add the values when a symbol of smaller value is written to the right of a letter of higher value. We add a smaller value to the greater value. Example, x, i. x has a value of 10. i has a value of 1. So, we add 10 and 1. The answer is 11. Next, l, v. l has a value of 50. v has a value of 5. Add 50 and 5. The answer is 55. Next, C, X. C has a value of 100. X has a value of 10. Add 110. The answer is 110. Rule number 3. Rule of subtraction. Subtract the values when a letter of lower value is written to the left of a letter with a big value. For example, XL. X has a value of 10 and L has a value of 50. 10 is lower than 50. So, XL will be 50 minus 10 is equal to 40. Next, XC. X has a value of 10 and C has a value of 100. 10 is lower than 100. XC will be 100 minus 10 is equal to 90. Next, CD. C has a value of 100 and D has a value of 500. 100 is lower than 500. C 
CD will be 500 minus 100 is equal to 400. A letter with smaller value can be written two letters with bigger values. Subtract it from the second letter with a bigger value. Examples. MXD equals 1490. M equals 1000. X is equal to 10. And D is equal to 500. Now, X which is 10 smaller than M and D. You have smaller number between two large numbers. Since X precedes D, you calculate it as 500 minus 10 equals let us base on rule number 3 says that subtract the values when a letter of lower value is written to the left of a letter with a big value. And 1000 plus 1000 Let's take a look at another example. CXC is equal to 190. C is equal to 100, X is equal to 10, and C is equal to 100. Since 10 is smaller than 100, you have smaller number between two large numbers. Since X precedes C, it is calculated 100 minus 10 equals 90. And 100 plus 90 equals 190. Another example, MCD. M is equal to 1000. C is equal to 100. And D is equal to 500. Since 100 is smaller than 1000 and 500, therefore, we subtract 500 minus 100 equals... 400 and 1000 plus 400 equals 1400 rule number four rule of multiplication a bar line above a letter show that the value has to be multiplied by 1000 examples x bar is equal to 10 times 1000 equals 10,000. Next, M bar is equal to 1,000 times 1,000 is equal to 1 million. Last, D bar is equal to 500 times 1,000 is equal to 500,000. That's all for today, children. Hope you enjoy learning. See you next time.